Good morning, East Islip High School. I'm your host, Andrew D'Amico. And I'm your host, Jason Vitrano. And here are your morning announcements for Friday, November 4th. This past Friday, October 28th, members from our school's National Honor Society chapter volunteered in JFK Elementary School's Trunk or Treat. Volunteers dressed up and decorated their car trunks to hand out candy to elementary school students. Some of our WFDK members made their way to capture the event. Let's check it out. November, everybody. This month is dedicated to growing mustaches and raising awareness funds for men's health. Several of our staffers participating in this month, including Mr. Fluffman, who has donated his upper lip to the cause for 30 days. In the past, we have raised over $2,000, and we need your help to continue. Grow your hair today and click the link below to donate. This week's Senior Spotlight, we have Liam and Jack from our broadcasting team interviewing BOCI students. Let's go to them now. Hello everyone. I am uh, I'm Jack Verlino, and uh, I'm here with Cole Sarney, Sarah Vasquez, Matthew Brody, and uh, Christian Anatra. So we're here going to talk about the BOCES program. What do you learn about? Like, what do you do there? All I learn about really is like there I'm doing the clinical medical assisting program. So I learn about we learn vital signs, how to perform tests in the office, what law enforcement officers have to do on a daily basis. Mm -hmm. Just like normal responsibilities for them. I learned about welding. Welding? Yeah. Uh -huh. oh, I, do, I do HVAC. HVAC? What's HVAC about? Heating, ventilation. Okay. What do you think the difference between going to BOCES and going to regular school is? The only real difference is kind of just you sit in one room for two hours. Um, the environment at BOCES is, I would say it's more welcoming. Um, you can kind of walk around the hallways without getting yelled at. You know, you learn a trade. Mm -hmm. um, you don't have to come here for five periods, so that's a plus. Okay. Uh, yeah, it's just a good thing to have. For me, I get like a 20, 30 minute break. Would you recommend the BOCES program to other students? I mean, I would, but if you're not like willing to go into it, I wouldn't, I wouldn't go into it. A uh, hundred percent. Yeah. hundred percent, yeah. hundred percent. Learn something useful. Yeah. BOCES in general, yes. My specific program, no. And where, where do you plan to go from here? You plan to have like a career in the program that you're learning, or kind of like I can get I can go from security jobs from here, so I'm probably gonna do that during college. So I actually work as a medical assistant already in an office. Okay, my um, bad. <laughs> um, but I'm hoping to use my CMA license to work throughout college. All right, and uh, that's about it. Anything else you want to say? Any message you want to give out to the world? Ah. Uh. Go to BOCES, you know? Yeah, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Why not? All right, that concludes this interview. Thank you, and I'll uh, see you next time. Thank you for that, Jack and Liam. Very inspirational. This past Friday and Saturday was East Essex High School's performance of Murder on the Orient Express. We had a great turnout both nights, and my friend here killed it as the Mafia boss. Thank you for that, Jason. You know what, Jason? I think it's time for a commercial. That sounds great. We'll be right back. Brought to you by WFDK Studios. Are you interested in filmmaking and want to learn how to make high quality videos with state of the art software? Join video production or come to Videovation after school. Speak to your guidance counselor about joining video production classes. Be creative and uh, make our own videos. It's my favorite part. All right, I'm getting tired. Let's go to James Stewart with the weather breakdown. What's going on East Islip? I'm here, James, with the weekend's weather forecast in East Islip. Friday, it's the start of November. We have a sunny day. Go outside, play some pigs game with the boys. Uh, six, highs of 69, lows of 51, a sunny day overall. Moving into Saturday, another sunny day. We really look forward to those days. Highs of 71. I mean, it's a beautiful Saturday. Go outside, get some vitamin D for the skin, and uh, enjoy it. But Sunday, not a fun day. Cloudy, highs of 71, so it's going to be a little hot. going to be hard to wear that raincoat. 
Lows of 60, but that's it for the weekend. Back to you guys. Take it easy, East Islip. That's all we have for this time, East Islip. Make sure to like and subscribe to our channel and go follow our Instagram. And always remember to be smart, be safe, and always wear your student ID.